It's Mr. Composition, the MC that writes fiction. And I'm coming to you live on day 16 of Vlogtober. And this is day 32 of my 100 day challenge, Keep It 100 With Thyself. Musical challenge where I release one song unreleased or old or new and yeah today's track is called the balance featuring <laughs> uh, totally by chance uh, my homeboy symmetry from grid squid entertainment out in san marcus oh man it feels amazing outside right now I chose that song for today because it's one of the things that I'm working on constantly is a balance. Storia said Atta, his whole thing was finding the middle path, not going so far one way or so far the other way. And what that reminds me, or what that makes me think of, <clears throat> is just getting back to the basics. This uh, particular month, October, will count as my sixth month of working for myself as a musician and a writer. You know, uh, several themes are reoccurring in my life, like being able to balance working home life or my health and being busy in general i'm not doing music part-time anymore and it almost feels like i'm back at you know square one but the way that i look at it is it's kind of like going from a particular subject like for example algebra one and then the next year going into algebra two now at the beginning of algebra two a lot of times they'll go through a refresher for about a couple of weeks maybe a month or two but it's to refresh so you're not going backwards, it's not sitting up there saying like, um, you know, that you're starting over. It's just a refresher. And you basically, it's kind of like going through all of year one algebra within a couple of weeks to a couple of months. So it's not going to take you the same amount of time to get through all the first level stuff again it's just a refresher and honestly that's how i feel now you know it's not to me i don't feel like i'm back at square one per se it feels like more so a refresher course and it's not going to take me as long to accomplish the things that i did the first time around as long as I'm learning <laughs> from, you know, the things that I did. A lot of times people, you know, will go into Algebra 2 and they go, oh, I know it all, but they just passed Algebra 1. Um, and there's several reasons why, you know, they could have not put as much effort or maybe they didn't understand it, but they did pass. And so they're looking at refresher stuff, possibly like, I don't need to be doing this but sometimes going back over the same stuff allows you to see all the stuff that you miss and with us only you know what we see is only a small percentage of what is and what we see all the time what we retain from that is a small percentage I have not gonna feel like I'm you know above anyone and the thinking that I know it all so I'm embracing getting back to the basics that's health wise that's you know 
music wise and just in my everyday endeavors and what does back to the basics look like for me because my back to the basics may be completely different to the next person and like I said it's, to me it's all about finding balance so one of the things that I ran into before we were working part-time, doing music part-time, doing school part-time, was finding a balance. During that time, that was the most that I weighed in my entire life. I was pushing well over 250, and now I'm 100 pounds lighter. And, you know, I feel like now I'm having this time to be able to look and be like, okay, this is what I need to be doing. Where is my balance at? What does balance look like to me? You know, so, just wanted to break that down. I'm super inspired, super hyped. Um, this last Saturday, uh, shout out to Amina and Vocab uh, for allowing me to show my light with several talented individuals as themselves um, shout out to Mia who also wrecked her performance amazing performance um, it was just a very inspiring day it was just good energy for a good cause um, I'm just happy to be a part of it you know so getting back to the basics and yeah continue showing my light so you can check out the song the balance featuring symmetry produced by ruler y with the link in the description section and yeah check out my first fiction novel ideas of illusion you can get that in paperback or an ebook that link will be in the description as well so man dope stuff happening I don't know uh, if y'all know who KT the arch degree is but he's gonna be in Dallas this Friday so I'm pushing to make it out there so I could catch his lecture he does dope breakdowns about movies Marvel movies uh, decoded you know just decoding all different types of movies you can check him out on YouTube um, and he's also big in vegan um, health and just healthy living in general you know he is a, one of those people that is yo I'm a this is what you should be doing and they don't their physical doesn't match with what they're saying you know it's kind of like that you know fat coach or something like that who you just like how do you even know you know uh or fat gym trainer it's just like how you how you gonna train me or whatever but you know he's the type of person that uh talks the talk and walks the walk this is someone who was directly influenced and taught by the late great Baba Dr. Savy, rest in power. So I'm super hyped. I've been watching his videos for ever since my homie Power. Uh, shout out to my homie Power had put me on to uh, KT the Arts degree. So I'm looking forward to you know getting that information, getting that knowledge, and and applying it and taking down notes and everything. And maybe I have some stuff to share with y'all. So, again, this is Mr. Composition, the MC that writes fiction. This is Vlogtober day 16, day 32 of uh, my Keep It 100 with Thyself challenge. So, I will holla at y'all. Peace.